let's look at an example. I want you to show, well first find what f inverse of x is, then show that the composition of f f inverse and f inverse f are both equal to their inputs. Alright, so we're given f of x equals x minus 5 over 2x plus 3. Let's first find f inverse. We can follow our steps. We get y equals x minus 5 over 2x plus 3. Switch the x and y's. We then want to multiply both sides by 2y plus 3. That gives us 2y plus 3 times x equals y minus 5. Distribute your x. Now group the y's on the same side. So we get 2xy minus y equals negative 3x minus 5. You can factor out a y. 2x minus 1 equals negative 3x minus 5 and then solve for y. y equals negative 3x minus 5 over 2x minus 1. I don't like having so many negatives in there, so I'm going to multiply through by negative 1 over negative 1. 3x plus 5 over 1 minus 2x. So f inverse of x is 3x plus 5 over 1 minus 2x. Alright, now we want to check that f of f inverse of x equals x. Well, let's look at this. We get What we're going to do is we're going to take what f inverse of x equals and we're going to plug it in for wherever x appears in f of x. We get 3x minus 5 over 1 minus 2x minus 5 all over, actually we'll keep the f inverse in blue, minus 5 and then 2 times 3x plus 5 1 minus 2x plus 3. Alright, we go through some algebra magic here. We get 3x minus 5, 1 minus 2x minus 5 times 1 minus 2x over 1 minus 2x all over Let's distribute that too, so we get 6x plus 10 over 1 minus 2x plus 3 times 1 minus 2x over 1 minus 2x. This gives us 3x minus 5 minus, I'm going to distribute this 5 up here, 5 plus 10x all over 1 minus 2x over 6x plus 10 plus, let's distribute this 3 as well, 3 minus 6x all over 1 minus 2x. Alright, because we're dividing by a fraction, that's the same as multiplying by its reciprocal. We get 3x Something went wrong. Oh, 3x plus 5, that's why. Okay. We get 13x over 1 minus 2x times 1 minus 2x over 13. 